Hello, welcome to my place. Come in. So, hi guys. Um, first of all, let me just turn you around and show you our vineyard. But we've made it a bit pretty by adding in the plants. Cup of tea. There you go. So, cheers. You're right. Is it hot? Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. All right. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. I am a travel blogger, but obviously in this pandemic, I'm not really travelling, so I'm going to show you around my house instead. We have lived here for a year, um, and we are just about to move out in a couple of weeks' time. So I thought, what better time than to show you around before we start packing and before we start making a real mess. Um, okay, so let me show you. First of all, we have the entrance hall where we leave our coats and shoes. Fun stuff. Yeah, and then well, this, that's quite... We come up the stairs. That's how, you, that's how you don't walk up the stairs. I've never done that in my whole life. Oh, pun times. Some more good times. Okay, so starting with the best first. This is my all-time favourite room in the house. It is the lounge. Hmm. <laughs> this is our blue sofa. We got this from Furniture123. Our cushions, we've gone for the blue and the gold vibe just in case you haven't realised. We've got our prints here from Decenio, gold and blue. Um, so, two things you'll notice in this flat. One, that we have a lot of plants. We've got my massive aloe vera. We've got all of these plants, there's mm. probably about 12 just in this room. Uh, even a string of pearls, another aloe vera and pomelo. Look at this. Is it a face or is it horses? It's a face from this angle. I only see horses. Three no, horses. look, if you stand where I am, it's a face. Really? Yeah, look at the legs and you see the two eye. Look, look. Look, the two horses' heads underneath yeah. it's, it's the eyebrows and that's the mouth. So we have a gorgeous mantelpiece here uh, with a face and three horses. Whichever one you see, I see the three horses. Will sees the face. Um, and. I think this is one of the most beautiful parts of the flat. And I also right. love these three windows here. Over why why on, do you like the windows? We're hey? on a high street. So sell the windows, have, sell me them. We can people watch out here. You like people watching? We love people watching. We've seen many a folk out here, haven't we? You like watching people. We do like watching people. What I did want to say is that our flat is quite mix and match. Um, We've got like a mix of modern and old. So this was my grandpa's table. Uh, a few of my grandparents passed away recently, so I have kept a lot of their things so that I can feel close to them. This is my grandpa's lamp. This is my grandpa's table, which I think is beautiful here, with the barley twist. And um, these are my grandparents. These are my grandparents. Uh, this is Decenio. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. I love this. My auntie gave me this. So we've got a lot of hand-me-downs. This table is my grandpa's as well, but we don't like the colour, so we've put a um, tablecloth over the top of it. This is Helen's. These are Helen's seats from her work. Um, they do interior designing. So this is quite cool, but like, as I said, there's a mixture of massive, old and modern. So we like it, it works. Um, this table we got from Gumtree like five years ago, didn't we, Will? Ten pounds. Ten quid. How amazing is that? It's good. No, 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 this one was twenty actually. Ten um, pounds each. And this one here, oh God, you're still going. FY exclamation mark. This is a cool gold blue. It's what we kind of really wanted. Gold blue, my blue. Just lots of gold and blue, basically. Yeah. So, hope you like. Hope you liked the best room in the house. Also, didn't show you this, but how snazzy is this? So if someone rings, we can watch them and we have had many a night where we've been singing to the neighbour. This is the kitchen. Welcome. This is a beautiful kitchen. Wooden worktops, a lovely sink. I absolutely love this sink. 
Um, yes, this is my handbag poster from, I think it's from Desenia, it might be from I, I Am FY. I need to check. Um, but we've also got a gas hob, which I never used to think that I liked gas hobs because I got freaked out from them, but actually this one is really good. It's got a safety catch and everything. Um, and that's our own microwave. Um, bits and bobs, another plant shock. This is my grandpa's, so that's why we've got a random gnome in the kitchen. Um, ovens, fridge, freezer. And this is our favourite little part of the kitchen. We've got some cacti, cacti. This sign I absolutely love, it's so true. And this sign, another string of pearls, candle and... This is my nan and granddad's temperature thermometer thing, which I think is quite cool. It might not go, but it's quite cool. Um, and then some more aloe vera and a dying basil plant. So, yes, that is... You need to feed that. It's I have watered it a couple of times today. No, yesterday. Oh, anyway, this is the snug. We've got our bookcase, our day bed, and the TV. You mm. may have noticed that in the lounge we did not have the telly or a TV at all um, and that's because we wanted to keep the lounge like a sociable place where we play games, talk, etc. Um, but it hasn't ended up being like that, we just sit on our laptops and do what everyone else does in there so it didn't really work. But we do like having an extra um, space for watching telly so we all snuggle up on here and watch Netflix on this bad boy. Um, this again we've had for absolutely years and years and years, but today Will doesn't know this, but I am painting it black. What do you think? You don't like it? Okay, well this is the before. <laughs> this is the before and I'll show you the after. Um, but I'm hoping that it will look quite snazzy because I don't like the silver. I like black gold. So that is the whole of the downstairs. Um, we love having the two separate um, reception rooms to either like chill out in here while one is working in there or um, whatever I usually do my teaching here. And yeah, so I hope you liked the downstairs. Now let's go upstairs. So what I really liked about this upstairs was the, the massive skylight there, it brings so much brightness into our hallway. And then we go into mine and Will's bedroom. This is our bed. Uh, I got this from Furniture 123 as well, where the sofa came from. These are all my Desenio prints here, which I like. Gallery wall, what do you think Will of our gallery, gallery wall? Yes. It's nice isn't it? Mm. Yeah, I'm also painting our bedside tables, so don't really look at them, they need to be sorted out. I'm painting those today. Um, these wardrobes, we are ever so lucky because they are, there's a lot, as you can see. Don't show what's inside. I know, I'm not going to open it. Our last place, we had like a full-on walk-in wardrobe, about three wardrobes each. This place, we have these. Next place, we don't have any, so we're going to have to get rid of a lot of clothes or buy a lot of wardrobes, one of the two. Um, and I do like it. I'm not going to show you too much because I, I have too many clothes for the space. Um, but they've all got lights as you open them, which I think is quite snazzy. So, that is here, our lovely bed. And we get a gorgeous, well, gorgeous amount of light coming in. It's always very bright. But living on a high street, we do hear the drunkards at night, 3am, having a laugh. This is my Girl Going Global poster from Louisa Elizabeth. Um, I absolutely love it. We've basically got a pin for everywhere we've been or like our wish list, Wonderless wish list. Um, and I really like this piece. I also painted this, but it kind of needs another paint because this is where I do my makeup and it's a bit dirty. Me and my Gramps, one of my favorite photos ever. Love him so much, miss him so much. So this is Helen's room. She's currently not here at the moment, um, but She's got a lovely wardrobe here. She's done her room really, really nicely. This is a gorgeous bed and the hope above her bed I bought her um, for her birthday last year because she is all about hope, which I think is lovely. So this is a very nice room. And then last two rooms of the house, we have the bathroom. 
I really like our bathroom because we have a separate shower and a bath. Money cat. <laughs> so that's the shower. And then this is the bath. It's quite a small bath, but it is a standalone bath, which I love. And um, it does the trick. You can just sit up in it and yeah, it's really lovely. So that is the bathroom. What do you think of the colour? I really like this colour. Oh, and also I have to show you this. This is very useful because it's a tuck away drying rack. Um, so you don't see it. And then last room in the house Smart. is the utility room. We also have a toilet in here, which is highly useful. Um, this is a Miel. Is that how you say it? Miel. What a Miel. <laughs> Um, apparently they are quite snazzy. We had one in the last place as well. What is it? Like it's a, it's on. a, meow. It's, it's always, it's a, no, it's a, it's a, a what? lights on. Meow. Oh. Meow. Lights go on. I think it's quite cool. I don't think Will even knows that there's lights in there. I just do poos in here. He hasn't actually done a wash since we've moved in. I just in. do lots of poos. Maybe. Um, but That's what I do read. Oh, how many washes have you done, honey? Mm. How many? I don't know about <laughs> What I do like about this is that you can, in the distance, actually see Wembley Stadium. You can't. Oh, can you not on the camera? Yeah. And then you can see the city of London. And you know, yeah, I can see it, obviously, yeah. we all can, but you can't see it on this. Oh, okay. Maybe you nice can. day. It is. Beautiful day. So, that is our... We've also got a cupboard here, which is highly useful. Oh, yeah, but you don't want to show that. I'm going to show it. It's just got our tennis rackets and our... Iron board, which we never ever use, hence this. <laughs> um, so, guys, that is the end of our tour of our little, I think it's a maisonette in London. So, things are very expensive. I think this is like 900 plus grand with an apartment. Um, but we are moving out, like I said, in a couple of weeks' time. Um, so, I will also do a flat tour when we move into our new place. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to moving. But also, in this vlog, I am going to show you my before and after of my painting. I'm gonna be spending the afternoon painting today. I am gonna get out of my snazzy top. I'm gonna to spend the afternoon painting, so I'm gonna show you and bring you along with me my painting. Uh, so let's go. <laughs> Today is paint day, um, didn't actually do it yesterday in the end, um, but this is the mirror that I want to paint white. I ordered an antique white paint from Amazon. Okay, so I thought I'd come outside and um, do this all so I don't get it all mucky inside. So as I was saying, this is the paint I got from Amazon, antique white, I think it was about 11, 12 quid. I believe. I'm also spray painting something black. I've never used spray paint before. And we've got paintbrush, masking tape, and sanding paper. So first thing is to sand it. Let's go. Okay, so this hasn't gone well. Whilst putting the masking tape on, I accidentally lent on it. I am so annoyed at myself. Well done, Laura. We've had this mirror for the last five years. And I wanted to paint it for the last three years. And the day that I've tried to do it, I've smashed it. What an idiot. Right, I've taped it up. It's ready to go to the tip. Gutted. Love you, beautiful mirror. Right, take two. I'm now painting my bedside table. So, 
let's turn this into an antique white. So this is the before bedside table. Yes, I'm not a fan of this Albany wood. It's just not my day. I have absolutely no idea how to open this. I've been using keys um, and it's just not budging. Uh, so I'll get back to you when I know how to open it. I butchered it. How the hell do you open it? Okay, so I had to Google it and apparently use a screwdriver. Use this, so hopefully this will now work. Yes! Ah. That was way too complicated. Do not use keys, they don't work. Go straight to the screwdriver. FYI. <laughs> okay. Wow. This is nice. Ooh. I like this. It actually feels really nice to paint. Turn it white. Okay, update. I've done the both bedside tables. Yeah, that's first coat done. I now have to paint this black. I have no idea how to use this one, but let's read and learn. So, update. I've come back a few hours later, about four hours, and this is really looking good. I mean, for the perfectionist, there's bits here and a bit over there that isn't the best. That's gonna look really good. Woo! Second layer is all on. Um, and also, I've still got half a tin left, even though this is a small tin. How many? 750 mil. So I'm gonna go and paint some chairs, I think. I'm just gonna do it. Let's do it. This is Rob and Mitch. So it is now pitch black and I've just finished doing the first layer of four of the chairs and I'm calling it a day. Thank you so much for watching everybody. I really hope you enjoyed looking around our home. Um, I'm looking forward to show you the next one as well. We move so much. We've literally lived in seven different places and we've been together for seven years, which is... Uh, crazy how much we've moved but anyway thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this please do subscribe if you liked it and bye for now